Not guilty. That's the plea entered by the man charged with the murder of Scott County's Deputy Sheriff Caleb Conley. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Marvin Bartlett. And I'm Andrea Walker. Stephen Xiangsheng appeared for his arraignment today at the Fayette County District Courthouse. Our Danielle Miskell was there and joins us now with the details. As we all know, arraignments don't last typically too long, so there wasn't much more that we learned here today of what will be the fate of Stephen Shang Shang, especially since he's been charged in two separate counties between here and Scott County. But what we do know is that he is facing five charges here in Fayette County, and he has pled not guilty to all of them. Good afternoon. You are Stephen Shang Shang. Is that your name, sir? This man, Stephen Shang Shang, was arrested Monday, charged with fatally shooting a deputy sheriff in Georgetown. Investigators say he took off to a Georgetown home, stole a car, and came into Fayette County, where he's accused of committing even more crimes. You are here today on charges of assault first degree, robbery first degree, convicted felon possession of a handgun, tampering with physical evidence, burglary second degree, two counts. These five charges came after investigators say Shang Shang shot a man at Rose and Jim's Bar and Grill, then stole that victim's Ford Bronco, heading down into Lexington and running into a home to hide from police. After this chaotic sequence of events, he maintains his innocence. Okay. About a dozen detectives were in the courtroom to bear witness to the plea. Judge Melissa Moore Murphy accepts it and appoints Shang Shang a public defender, who asks that specimens taken from the crime scene by the police be preserved for analysis. The judge accepted the motion and requested it to be sent to her in writing. Bond is set for $100,000 cash for charges on assault, robbery, possession of a handgun, and tampering with physical evidence. Shang Shang's next court appearance will be Friday, June the 2nd at 8.30 a.m. in room three of the Fayette County District Courthouse. Now, I have reached out to the Commonwealth's Attorney Office in Scott County to learn how he will be arraigned on his charges in Scott County. Those charges include his biggest charge, murder of a police officer. I am still waiting to hear back. So for now, reporting in Lexington, I'm Danielle Miskell, Fox 56 News.